Good morning, we are group 10 and today we'll be doing our presentation on the movie 42. Our agenda for today. We'll begin with a brief synopsis of the film followed by the five different leadership theories we'll be covering and end off with a conclusion. Jackie Robinson is a black league baseball player in 1946 who refuses to accept racism. Branch Rickey, the general manager of the Brooklyn Dodgers, hires Jackie to be the first African-American major league player, breaking the color barrier. This will become a major change for Jackie as he faces unrelenting racism on and off the field, both from players and fans. As Jackie fights against his nature to endure such abuse without complaining, his outstanding performance on the field begins to win over his teammates, and Jackie gains support through his performance and dedication, becoming a symbol of hope and inspiration for his community. This presentation will cover five dif different leadership qualities shown through the film, specifically the value of conflict, visionary leadership, teamwork, effective communication, and building relationships. Racism is the main conflict in the film 42. We see this in the altercation between Ben Chapman and Jackie Robinson. In this scene, Jackie is at the home plate trying to hit the ball when Ben Chapman, the Phillies manager, begins to hurl racial slurs and insult, distracting him from the game. The harassment eventually becomes too much for Robinson, causing him to flee. After a pep talk from his manager, Brian Jerky, Jackie pulls himself together, leading his team to victory. Following the aftermath of this event, the public begins to question Ben's leadership, resulting in a backlash. To protect his image, Ben requests a photo op with Jackie to show the public that there was no hard feelings between the pair. At this event, Jackie suggests to use a baseball bat instead of shaking hands, so that they wouldn't have to touch skin, referring to Ben's racist comments. This awkward photo was taken at this event. The scene was a very effective form of conflict as both gentlemen looked very uncomfortable. Despite the animosity between the pair, they sacrificed their pride to save their future. This moment was a real eye-opener for Robson's teammates as it was the first time they realized how brutal the harassment was. Eddie Stinky, one of Robinson's teammates, even confronted Ben for his abusive behavior, which encouraged other team members to do the same. The team began to bond with Jackie, including him in conversations and activities. Sportsmanship and trust, as well as Robinson's hard work and dedication, helped improve the team's overall performance. The team grew stronger and became more in sync with one another. The fans began to notice this new dynamic as Jackie would not let conflict stop him from achieving his goal. This interaction with his team members allowed Jackie to be seen in a new light. The scene could have been better if they showed more of Jackie's internal struggle with racism. The scene where he breaks his baseball bat was very powerful and the only time the audience sees how much these words hurt. Having more scenes like this could have made the movie more impactful. Visionary leadership is an important leadership theory that allows others to see a dream as one. Visionary leadership is when a leader has a clear idea of how they see the future, can inspire people, and help to see and understand that dream. It gets people to empathize with the vision and understand why it is something that should be achieved. Visionary leadership was used in the movie 42 by Branch Rickey to sow the seeds of equality by bringing Robinson to the White Baseball League. It was also used by Pee Wee Reese when he put his arm around Jackie on the field in camaraderie. This showed the fans that hate breeds hate after seeing the crowd booing and calling Jackie racial slurs. The crowd then quiets a bit as Pee Wee has shown that him and Jackie are equals as not only men but as teammates, pushing the dream and vision of equality forward. This theory was very effective as it could be used on and off of the field for the team or for the audience. As mentioned previously, it aided in bringing people together by example and inspires people to follow that dream. The only other approach I see working nearly as well would be the affiliative leadership because it would work to help bring the team together through promoting harmony, empathy, and boosting morale. This would not work quite as well as the aforementioned example because it would mostly focus on the team and not external factors like the audience or other teams. 
A concept that was seen in the movie 42 was teamwork. The theory teamwork means two or more people working together by interacting and coordinating their roles and tasks to accomplish a shared goal or purpose. The result of teamwork is initially a more productive team that is highly motivated and is capable of using each member's different abilities and skills to excel and further succeed in what shared objectives and goals the group has. The elements that come into play for how effective groups teamwork is include the team environment, individual actions of each member, communication amongst the team, traits and roles of members, and the objectives. The concept of teamwork is portrayed in many scenes of the movie. Branch Rickey, the owner of the Dodgers, was one of the main factors of what teamwork was displayed throughout the movie. He believed that Jackie Robinson could handle the pressure of being the first African-American player in the league and believes his talent of baseball will help change the view of society and break the color barrier in baseball. With Branch Rickey's strong belief, he influenced and preached to the Dodgers team and the managers that Ro Jackie Robinson must be treated with the same fairness and respect as any other member of their team if they still wanted to be a part of the Dodgers as there was a petition that was being passed around to get Robinson kicked out. With Branch Rickey having such a strong opinion on Jackie Robinson, it led to many incidents where the team members actually portrayed the concept of teamwork in their actions. Pee Wee Richards portrayed teamwork at their game in Cincinnati where he puts his arm around Jackie, showing the entire arena that he accepts Robinson as a teammate and is setting an example for not only the rest of his team, but to everyone watching. Another scene was when Eddie Stanky stood up for Jackie Robinson when Ben Chapman was yelling racial slurs to him during a game. Eddie stood up for Jackie knowing that he could not defend himself and made it aware to Chapman that if he wanted to pick on someone to pick on someone who can actually fight back. Eddie Stanky portrayed teamwork through the idea that if one member has to go through something, they all will go through it together as a team rather than letting Jackie fight his own battles. Jackie then thanked Eddie for standing up for him. The last incident was when Fritz Ostemuller from the opposing team threw a pitch directly at Robinson's head on purpose. The whole Dodgers team ran onto the field to defend Robinson, which ended up in a brawl between both teams. This showed the value and respect they had for Robinson and that as a team they'll defend each other. Overall, in each of these scenes, it demonstrated how the concept of teamwork was effectively initiated as members of the team were able to accept Jackie Robinson as one of them, no matter the color of his skin, with the help of Branch Rickey consistently believing in the talent that Jackie Robinson had. The display of teamwork opened the color barriers in baseball, creating the opportunity and normalizing African-American players in mixed teams playing in the National Leagues. Effective communication is an important theory in creating a mutual understanding between one another. As messages can be delivered through verbal and nonverbal symbols, it allows for the sender and receiver to develop a greater perception of any situation. This theory highlights the sending, receiving, and feedback of information between individuals as it looks at both management communication as well as leadership communication. Effective communication is important as it can alter an organization and its workers perspective for the better on key issues they are surrounded by. If there tends to be a weak point in communication, it can create inaccuracies, reduce productivity, and create conflict amongst colleagues ultimately affecting overall performance. This is why effective communication is viewed as an underlying factor in moving forward with any business or organization as it helps reduce confusion and allow for a better understanding which helps enhance the overall performance of each other. This theory was showcased in the movie 42 as Branch Rickey, who was the LA, Do LA Dodgers manager, displayed effective communication with the entire baseball organization. By taking stand and supporting Jackie Robinson, Branch Rickey displayed effective communication by telling players, coaches, and staff members that Jackie Robinson should be treated fairly and equally just like everyone else. With Branch Rickey using regular communication to great effect, the perspective of having Robinson removed from the league started to change. Another example where the movie 42 displayed effective communication was when Pee Wee Reese supported Robinson on the field by putting his arm around him. It showed that the vision, purpose, and understanding between a white and black player can be and should be the same, which Pee Wee Reese portrayed through this nonverbal symbol for the public. Everyone's perspective on Robinson continued to change as he developed leadership communication by showing importance to his teammates regardless of the negative comments towards him. His actions and nonverbal messages on and off the field inspired the rest of the team to achieve the main vision and bigger picture. He played like a leader for his team, which by the end of the season, rather than telling him he doesn't belong here, had developed a mutual understanding that color does not define who a person is and what he can or can't do. Therefore, the implementation of this theory displayed by Bran Tricky and Pee Wee Reese was executed success successfully and requires no improvement as they help direct the society's perspective and understanding that having a black baseball player in the major league should not be nothing out of the ordinary. 
Building trust in relationships is a very important aspect when creating a bond, in which would then blossom into a strong connection through this initial leadership theory applied. Building a trustworthy relationship allows deeper relationships to build since it creates the chance for individuals to work together, belong, and feel safe in a work environment. By being one to create a connection with a friend, co-worker, or even a stranger, you are allowing an opportunity to accept open communication that would lead to understanding each other's needs and concerns. This theory is very important as that initial chance to improve your trust can be crucial to become a strong leader, especially in an organization where you are managing multiple people. In the film 42, Branch Rickey, who is a manager of LA Dodgers at the time, implements this theory exceptionally well with a player named Jackie Robinson. Jackie, especially during the beginning of his career, had multiple off-the-diamond issues regarding the color barrier present in the major leagues. Branch was one to give Jackie a chance in the first place and gave him multiple opportunities to prove himself, showcasing the level of trust present. Throughout the film, their relationship became very important and grew throughout the season, as Jackie knew he had someone in his corner, which gave him the confidence to fulfill his dreams and become a trailblazer for future black athletes in baseball and sports around the world. Therefore, the implementation of his theory by Branch was perfectly executed and would require little to no improvement due to the large success both of them achieved by giving trust. By that initial trust, Jackie gave Branch allowed his career to make a jump to the MLB at the same time was unprecedented and further created the opportunity for each other to work together by resolving on-field issues. The film 42 is a powerful and inspiring story about leadership and teamwork. We can learn from Jackie's experience the value of effective communication, relationship building, and conflict resolution, and more. These characteristics enable Jackie to break baseball's color barrier and become a symbol of hope and inspiration for future generations. The outstanding performance of Chadwick Boseman as Jackie Robinson makes this film a must-see for anyone interested in leadership, teamwork, and overcoming adversity. This concludes our presentation. We hope you enjoyed.